Hi Leo, this is Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and this is your weekly uh, for the 6th to the 12th of April and it's beautiful weather here today, it's ooh, 20 centigrade so it's pretty warm and yet it is uh, the first time it's been that hot. I hope you are okay and safe and sound and healthy in uh, this period of time with the virus going on. Let's pray that everybody will stay safe and healthy. Today there was uh, this morning I was up at 5.45 doing my meditation to help to shift the power between Pluto and Jupiter and things will change. Big things are going to happen. Load, and there has been something like uh, one and a half million people that have been meditating so I hope it helps. That's why you will see also a video on meditation um, and I let's pray and send our love and healing out to those that need it and ask the universe for this magical shift. Uh, things are going to change and I think a lot of the old ways are coming back people bringing people together respecting the environment and each other let's hope so let's have peace and no more war um, and if you're new welcome to the channel please subscribe and hit that bell but and then when you hit that bell take the choice all otherwise you will not be notified and welcome back cyber angels my true and faithful followers thank you for your support this is also news for you because we are in a new system so make sure everybody that you are subscribed and that you've not been deleted uh, from your favorite channels so if you check it out your subscriptions and if you uh, have subscribed somewhere then check underneath the bell if you have subscribed to all otherwise you will not be notified there's information below this video in the description box and also this little white button that will take you to the website and there you can find more information you can see the reviews and interviews etc etc okay let's get started the first card that you have is from the Lenaman and that is the tree so I'm not using the cartomacy sign I'm just using the number numerology and the sign of the Lenaman you've got the tree that means health how is your health I uh, hope well and uh, it also means family tree it also means that you are rooted where you are you feel safe but you do need space and perhaps you are worrying too much about this the situation now don't be because we're all in the same boat and there is enough people around you to phone to connect with and to ask for help don't be afraid to ask for your help if it stresses you out it's no good for your health go outside if you can even if it's on the balcony or just in front of your door or just up the road and down the road with the dog and uh, that will just relax you a little bit and if not then do the meditation watch the little video I made when I did my meditation and use it it will relax you okay because 5 also means that you're out of balance your health will improve okay have no illusions or disillusions about that because you've got the magician stay true to yourself there is a new beginning he's also number one so that also means a new beginning be you have all the talents and gifts in and around you to make your wish or goal come true perhaps your hobby might become your work perhaps this is what you are learning to be more conscious of yourself and your health and that quality is better than quantity and to take things uh, easy and gently not to um, uh, uh, pretend that you're all right when you're not all right so don't give anybody illusions because the magician does means illusions and disillusions don't be disillusioned in dissolution don't be disillusioned in life you can have love you will have love 
love, deep affection and uh, caring uh, is around you or perhaps you are like that Leo make sure that you are surrounded and know that you are surrounded by love okay be open be more conscious of what is happening around you and look at this you've got the coin so that means money coming in and you've got the tree it, the tree is green you are doing something that will grow and bring and bear fruit okay it's like a tree slow and steady in the middle of the week you've got the sun you've got the sun and it's 31 31 means fall so there something will be built on proper foundations and it will grow and it will last okay it will give you steadiness the sun means you're in the spotlight something is being illuminated perhaps your health perhaps you're not taking proper care of yourself okay you might be moving home you might be going on holiday or planning a holiday for when you can travel again you might be getting married or your relationship will go up to a next level perhaps you might get a promotion like I said you've got all the elements around you and in you like wisdom and you're not disillusioned and you're not making any illusions you are staying with two feet firm on the ground so it could be a promotion it could be more customers in your business once this thing is over so don't worry about it people are also or people um, that could be a Leo you are in your element Leo because you are in the sun in the spotlight or perhaps there is an other Leo that has seen you and will give you a promotion or wants a relationship with you you've attracted somebody's attention and the sun also means illumination you might need m to do more research with regard to a situation or uh, a question you've got the hierophant and the hierophant represents Aries and it could be an other fire sign um, sorry the hierophant is Taurus um, it is the Emperor but the Emperor is a lot like the Hierophant okay but the Hierophant is Taurus and so you might be meeting a Taurus or a Taurus might have an eye on you but the Hierophant also has the scroll the Torah and the book of life he has the wisdom he has the knowledge like the high priestess so you might be seeking advice with regards to marriage perhaps okay because he's a high priestess high priest I mean and he marries people so it might be with regarding to marriage it might be regarding to buying a house since the Sun is moving a home okay uh, it could also mean that you are um, if you have got a business and you're worried about your business what can you do what is legal can you get a grant can you get a loan uh, is that feasible is that a good plan so you might even go to your bookkeeper or your accountant and discuss business about your business let's see because you've got the quill and that is also uh, for communication because in the olden days they used to write with the quill nice. these cards you cannot pick up they're not thick enough and I don't like that get back to basics like I said right at the beginning this time is changing we are going back to the old-fashioned way in a lot of ways we're going to get back together again back to basics we're going to respect the environment more uh, that is what the message is with this big thing that's happening now you've got the star so your wish or your goal is coming true like the magician so you are navigating your way 
to what you want. Now, at the end of the week on Friday, you have the um, path, the, the path, the crossroads. There's decisions, decisions or uh, choices to be made. Perhaps you've got more than one choice. You've got an angel number 22, so there is a gateway. There is a gateway at the end of the week. And you've got the sun here and the moon there. Remember, there's a dark side to something and the light side. So that's why you need more information, the same as the sun, before you carry on to this new beginning new beginning new beginning because it could be you could be finding out that you are expecting or your partner is expecting a baby and um, if you don't want to get pregnant then take precautions this could be a birth of a job or a, a, a new project like I said there's a beginning here beginning there um, the choices are here as well before you st go any further that the angel number is a new beginning a portal um, so you know there is new beginnings and um, you've got the king of swords something will become clear to you this is a Gemini uh, um, the, 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 the king of swords is Gemini he represents Gemini but don't exclude Reba, Libra or Aquarius as they are also air signs but he stands for clarity justice and balance he uh, represents wisdom communication and justice so you again you need to talk to somebody uh, you could be a person that is in a judicial system or a bookkeeper or an advisor you've got definitely it the cards are saying for you this week Leo um, get advice don't just sit there or ponder um, but take action get clarity get more information this and do it in the right way do it in an honest way uh, otherwise you will have to repent in leisure don't uh, disillusions don't uh, uh, how do you say it don't be the magician be a true magician but not with illusions be clear about what you want and what you are doing so make the honest choice because otherwise you'll have to repent in leisure a new job a new career that is pin the pin means it's pinned down that you're getting a new job or a new career perhaps this time has woken you up to wanting something new and more stable now we had stability somewhere and that is the tree you're putting you want to put down roots you want something stable you don't want the insecurity that this time has brought you perhaps you've got the steering wheel of a boat so you've got the wheel the uh, you can take this as the wheel of fortune what goes round comes round the karma you, what goes up must come down um, so if you've done good you'll get it back threefold if you've done bad then you'll get it back threefold like I said stay honest and be true show you can't do the tricks but don't do it with trickery do it legally that is what is coming out you might be like all the spokes of the wheel you might go up in upper level again the Sun is uh, saying that as well you might go up in a relationship in to the next level or in your job you might get a promotion Wow 
and the wheel also means moving home or going on holiday having a trip look at the wheel there you go see it much clearer so you're going you're going to better times okay you might be meeting the love of your life but we've got the air signs here that's the king and here we've got the lady now I said I wouldn't take that sign but that is the air sign so you've got 29 again an angel number number 11 11 and 11 is 22 so it is something with synchronicity um, playing with let numbers so you've got two angel cards okay uh, two angel numbers sorry you could be meeting the love of your life and it could be an air sign because these would be a couple if you are not meeting a lady this means that your feminine side let if you're a man let the feminine side come out the same with the being a woman if you are a female Leo then let your feminine side come out be nurturing uh, nurture yourself beautify yourself do something for yourself everybody needs to feel good so you, everybody from time to time needs to tickle themselves it is only um, good for your health the woman stands for uh, love, passion, nurturing, sexuality and sensuality. Ooh. Now the overall energy is 34, 7 is good luck and you've got the fish. The fish means you can work well in groups but at the moment we can't. But you can partner up through cyber and form partnerships there learn how to work with somebody else from a distance um, this also means luck in business or at work like getting more clients I've already talked about that here don't worry about it but know your boundaries like I said if it is feasible to extend or to carry on or to start your own business okay but be clear about it that is the message here know your boundaries and let others know your boundaries because fish do not know their boundaries that's the overall energy there will be a news coming from to you this could be from um, as you have the Knight of Pentacles, this could be an Earth sign, Virgo, Capricorn, or Taurus, Leo. They are bringing news. This could be new. This is news for with durability and long term, on how to make more money and to feel safe, never to be in this situation again. Uh, that you are in like being tied up perhaps you've decided that you want to work from home so that when you are lo on lockdown that you can still carry on and do work you might go 50 50 that is what I'm seeing working 50% of the time at home and 50% at the office or on the road because the wheel is here as well so the wheel is turning something is turning okay you might have competition uh, the five of ones is competition and it is a mock fight people are learning here um, joisting usually the five of ones means that a couple of boys are fighting with the sticks joisting uh, they are training so you might have been training to get to where you are now for this new beginning um, also there might have been disagreements but they're, mm, they're not serious they're not long lasting it is time for you to start getting clarity and moving on you've got the clouds temporary problems but you've got the clock temporary problems 
clouds, yes. In the Lena model, the clouds mean arguments, but they're short-lived because the sun is already breaking through. So there's a temporary a problems. You cannot go to work. And you've got the clock here. It is time to think, what can you do? What, how can I improve? How can I get this promotion? Because you've got a new job or career. Um, and also the Wheel of Fortune means uh, it could be a move from uh, m um, moving home so something new is coming in okay could be a promotion at the next level you might be partnering up getting married because the Hierophant is here so it is something to do with partnerships you've got choices the lady is here as well so something that you love and that you love to nurture twig it it's the time to twig now surrender your addictions Ooh. whether you're addicted to substances food people sex or overworking take action it's time to begin to heal the addiction and replace it with a healthier alternative well I'll tell you this much Leo if you are if you do have any addictions then change it because otherwise it will cost a relationship or friendships in the future be wise focus on peace and love that is your inspiration card tranquility and that is what I'm also getting from this reading tranquility anticipate a world at peace expect health abundance the coin love it could be love your wish coming true the wheel more you're going up to the next level all positive and love in your life 